What is going on today? We're back in here playing some more Madden 24 online head to head. Today, we're back in today. As I was recording my last episode, which is the Chris Jones re signs with the Chiefs and Mac Jones gets traded from the Patriots to the Jaguars, we had a breaking news uh, come across. Before we get into it, though, my record going into this is 63 and uh, 63 and 75. So yeah, um, let's get into it. So my uh, the news comes from this team right here, the Philadelphia Eagles. Actually, no, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. My fault. My fault. What am I doing? What am I doing? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. So without further ado, let's get into it. I know I've already sort of made a video on this, but no, not a 49ers user. Ooh, yes, perfect. It kind of revolves around both these teams, the Bears and the Eagles. The Bears have signed former Philadelphia Eagles and Tennessee Titans safety Kevin Byard to a two-year deal. It's the NFL oh, Kevin Byard is going to Chicago to team up with Jalen Johnson Chicago. in that secondary. He's their Eddie Jackson replacement. So this is perfect. Um, yeah, so Chicago's already off to a hot start getting Kevin Byard to team up with uh, Jalen Johnson in that fucking secondary. That secondary is going to be crazy. If you have one of the best safeties in the league and one of the best corners in the league, bro. Cabrono. And we also have to talk about uh, Fletcher Cox. Bro's retired today. I mean, we already talked about it last in the last video, but since we're playing with the Eagles, why not talk about Fletcher Cox? Eagles are off to a crazy, cover nine you, crazy start to their offseason. Jason Kelsey and Fletcher Cox are gone. Uh, Kevin Byard's gone. Good shit. Monta Josh Sweat. Cover nine show two. So now following the sack, Fields and the Bears looking at third down and long. Pick that. Byard! Kevin Byard! Get there, buddy. Yes, sir, Kevin Byard. The man that we're the, about. The man that we're talking about in this video. Kevin motherfucking Byard. Good shit, boys. Partner, you'd have to think that this was part of their game plan coming in because they wanted to embrace an aggressive mindset and attack on defense. They were trying to force that quick miscue. Seven nothing. Their plan worked to perfection. Elliot good on the extra point, and it's now a seven. Let's go, baby. So they throw the pick six. They'll get another shot at it now, as this one's in the air. Yeah, Philly. Philly's uh on the down. Scott on the return. Trending down. I'd say Chicago's trending up. And only able to get this to the 19, so probably should have opted for the Cover on a hole. At the line, prepping for their next drive, the Bears Here we offense. go. Now remember, they were just out here a moment ago through the pick six, so we'll see if they can take better care of the football this go around. And sometimes, Shit. partner, I think it's almost better right. that you just throw the pick six and you come right back out on the field. You're not over on the sidelines. Cover on a hole. You're not hearing everyone say, oh, hey, you'll get them next time. Oh, Fletcher. Don't worry about it. All that stuff just goes right out the window. You're right back out on the field with a chance to atone. Nice hit. Just a yard on the pickup there, and it'll bring up a second and nine. No doubt about it. Cover nine, shake two. Nice job there by the defense, not allowing him to get to the perimeter. But that means your defensive end, your outside linebackers, the guys that you pay big money to to sack the quarterback. They also have to have interest in the running game as well. And they did a nice job there holding the Good hit. And not giving ground. And he'll take it down shy. Nicobe Dean, cover nine, show two. 
So on the other side of the field now, it's first and ten as they've got things rolling on this drive. Fields. He's got the I feel like the Eagles, though, they won't be that, like, bad. Like, at replacing those guys. One, one run replace. I mean, Jason Kelsey, he's going to be hard to replace. But Fletcher Cox, that, that, they have Jordan Davis and Jalen Carter. They're not really hurting for D tackles. You know what I'm saying? Like, they have two easy guys that can come in and replace him. Jalen Carter and Jordan Davis. Cover two men. Safeties. I mean, they have Reed Blankenship. They got Sidney Brown. Oh, they also got rid of Avante Maddox. He's gone, too. Nope. And they also might get rid of Hassan Reddick. They're just, like, tearing apart their defense. Cover two invert. He's going for it. So it looks like the offense isn't going anywhere. They're going to go for it on fourth and seven. Pick that. Thank you. Kevin Byard again. Kevin Byard again, baby. Oh! Two pick sixes by the man that just signed with the Bears, Kevin Byard. So they go on fourth down. Not only A. It turns into six points the other way, disaster. Hey. And many people think you should just go ahead and knock it down in that situation, turn it over for the offense. But I had a defensive coordinator recently tell me, we see that as a passive play. We don't do that anymore. We want the ball in our hands, and we want to head the other way. It's probably also instinct. Our offense has not touched the field yet. 14 nothing. It's the exact right play to do. That's knowing when to break the rules and when to make a play that maybe you hadn't been taught. So they'll get another shot on offense following that pick six. And now the kick is away. And that one will bounce out of the back of the end zone. So we will start here. Cover six. At the, 25. the Bears offense ready to go for their next drive. And job one here, Charles, just keep possession of the football. Two drives, two turnovers to this point. You're exactly right, Doctor. Hippocratic oath. First, do no harm. And right now, they're harming themselves. All right. Like Sydney Brown just got bitched, but it's fine. But thank you, Dr. Davis. Cover on all. start to the drive, 17 yards, and moves the sticks. One play has him up past the 40 already, and another first and 10. Herbert powering up the middle. Nice hit. And he'll manage to pick up about four. It's second down. And that was a quality play to start when he sent it down. That was simply an offensive line winning the battle up front and winning in a big way and giving their guy in the backfield a nice lane to hit. Nope. They try to throw on second down, but this one is incomplete. The touch and time man. Cover two men. Types of throws. He put a lot of zip on that one. Needed just a little bit more finesse trying to get it to his back. From the gun on third down, Fields. Kevin Byard again? Oh, bro gone. Bro's gone. Bro's gone. Already. Already bro's gone. 64 and 75, baby. Let me run it again. A cold Caesar bet. We are at the home of the Super Bowl 52 champions, Lincoln Financial Field in Philadelphia, PA. Coming up, we've got what should prove to be a good one, as it'll be the Indianapolis Colts taking on the Philadelphia Here we go, baby. Eagles. Kevin Byard already had a fucking game, bro. Three picks, two pick sixes. Britton Covey. Let's go, Britton. Ah. HP stretch. First and ten, and kind of tipping their hand at running the ball. Three tight ends are out there. They'll start on the ground with Swift. Go Swift. Shane Steichen, coaching against his former team. He used to be the OC for the Eagles. Switch X, come back. Well, there you go. The 
this offense off to a strong start this afternoon. Yeah, with a big run and a first down. That's putting what you practice into play. That's excellent execution to get things started. Oh. Throw on first down there, but it's incomplete. They are such a talented team at defending the perimeter. Dagger. And taking away throws to the outside. Great confidence, great skill. Second and ten. Throwing his hurts. Balluting the pressure right. That's a pick. Oh, AJ. Oh, I thought he got that. That would have been a sick catch, bro. Escape. In that department. Third down. Well, that was an interesting look there because as soon as he got outside the pocket, I thought he was going to take off and run for yardage. But what often happens now with these quarterbacks who can move, defenses want to try and keep bot. That's not P.I., bro. Like, how is that not P.I.? Oh my god, cover one robber. Like, how is that not a fucking... Whatever. He's playing with Gardner Minshew, really? Why? You have Anthony Richardson, and you play with Gardner Minshew. Okay, now he's gonna switch. Like, he literally got in my way, in the way of Dallas Goddard trying to fucking run his rope. Like, how the fuck is that not P.I.? swinging on the next series number nine show two there for the tackle now a second and six they run once more with Taylor. I said a short game here maybe a yard to the 29 well done to sniff that out defensively he had it diagnosed pretty quickly I love that description because one robber press red is keys come on big Fletch come on Fletch Nope. Hey, yeah, take your three. You got it. Alright. Three nothing. That's fine. This wasn't a touchdown. That's <laughs> fine. Yeah, we can make this one pretty simple, partner. You always want to end drives with points. Britain, run it. Britain, at. run it, buddy. And probably say we should have done better there. And he'll be stopped right around where he would have been had he gone down to a knee, maybe a yard shy of their HP stretch. The Eagles offense set to begin their next drive. They threw an interception the first time they had the football, only gave up three points off of that, so it shouldn't be a difficult hole to overcome. It really nice. shouldn't as long as they're not listening to the chatter coming from the other side, because when you throw a pick, look, I know defensive backs, PA FL stretch. They have a tendency to be a little bit loud after they take one away, but they also have a tendency to gamble a little bit more thinking they'll get a second one. Maybe they can take advantage of that with some double moves. Play action. Here's Hurts. I can't do anything when there's a guy right on my ass, bruh. What do you want me to do? What the fuck do you want me to do? There's a guy right on my ass, and I can't do anything. Hey, Devontae Smith, you want to go up and get this ball? Hey, yo, Devontae Smith, you want to go up and get this motherfucking ball? Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. Devontae Smith. Good shit, Devontae. I seen that one on one coverage. I was like, I'm hitting him. Is that, like oh. one of your turkey bowl games, isn't it? <laughs> Just go long, Back man. Yard. I'll hit you. And it worked really well for them. But now if they wanted to, they could move the ball up to the one and go for two. Yeah, that's exactly right, because normally the ball's at the two when you go for two. But if they want it now, I should have actually left for two, but it's fine. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliot on to kick it away. From a yard or two deep, here comes a return. Nice hit. And he'll get it up past the 20 to about the 22. 
This is Shaq Leonard's former team too. Cover three cloud. They'll run with Taylor to begin the nice drive. And he can only manage to get a couple. Second and eight coming up. Cover six. When we talk about defenders, specifically linebackers, keeping their eyes in the right spot. He had that eye down the entire time. And you know that's not easily done because they throw nice a this direction at you. They try and fool you and get your eyes in the wrong place. Tampa two. He correctly figured that one out and made a really nice play. Third and one, Richardson to throw. Oh, Jalen Carter. Go for it. Mike will blitz. No! Oh, come on, guys. Cover nine, show two. Successful. Now they look to pay it off on first down from the shotgun. Richardson. Oh. Throwing middle, but it's incomplete. I think he's got to be careful not to force anything into coverage right there. There weren't really any throwing lanes. One Robert Press. He's got second and third down to fall back on. Seven pirates, seven pirates. Richardson looking to throw this. Oh, Bree Blankenship, bro. What are you doing? <coughs> Cover three, Sky. What? How was that not a sack, bro? Cover on all. Forcing the incompletion. That gives them a quick chance to regroup and try and mount a stand before they're backed up even further. I say that'll be the end of the first quarter. To the end of the first quarter. After one, seven, three, the score on EA Sports. Cover nine, show two. Ninth play coming up here on this drive. This is third and a yard. Nice. Good shit, Jalen. Overstorm Brave. Nice. Good shit, Jim Nicobe Dean. Pierre Reed. Already at the line, this Philly offense set to go. They go play action with Hertz. This time, oh my God, bro! What are you throwing? The, the fuck is that? I hit the wrong button, I think, too. I didn't even try to throw it to Devonte Smith. I tried to throw it to fucking AJ Brown. Fucking gay ass shit, bro. Give me that. That's into a crowd and intercepted. Fuck you, Kevin Byer. Get that shit back. And he'll learn that you have to hold the safety. And you do that with your head movement, your eyes, sometimes your shoulders. Hold the safety so that you can get the ball. with Jalen with that first. Thank you. PA cross. Good coverage downfield led to him taking off, picking up the first down on a 13 yard run. Off the play fake. Here's Hurts. Okay, man. a shot on the release as this will be incomplete. I think he had to unload that one before he wanted to. He was right up in his RPO pin alert level. There without a license, don't you? <clears throat> <laughs> Just not enough time for the play to develop. Just lucky it wasn't a fumble, really. Here's a quick throw yep, okay, Alameda is the key. Just don't fucking block. It's fine. Should run slot two buck again? I think they have Devontae on a one-on-one. -on -one? Oh my god, bruh. Not again. Not again, bruh. Not again you're gonna do this. Oh, I didn't have time. 
I didn't have time because my fucking somehow the best O line in the league is shit. But okay, I'm not sure you could actually draw a better pass. I would have had Devontae Smith though, so that would have been funny as hell. He had to keep backing up and backing up and backing up. Eventually dropped for a huge loss. And this will be down just inside the 30 yard. How did that take a shit ass backspin? Cover nine show two. The Indy offense at the line and set to go. And for this offense, Charles, you got to think kind of crucial here to put something together on this. Because remember last time out, they threw the interception on the very first play. Tampa two. Let this defense keep building any more momentum. They're playing awfully well and they're awfully confident right now. To me, it's time to attack. Oh, Vontae Maddox, what are you doing? Cover three cloud. Oh, nice. James Bradbury. Outside zone. And then I can't move because there's fucking guys in the backfield. RPO rebubble. Hey yo, uh, whoever's blocking on the outside, do you want to like actually block this time or? Nope, you don't. You don't. You don't. You just want to fucking leave him wide open. Escape. Fucking, what are we doing right now? Wasting this great starting field position, a real threat. This is third and long. Hurt sets up to throw it. Flushed out right, looking for the end zone. And that will be incomplete. I saw that last minute. That's my fault. I'll take the three. I'll just take the three. It's fine. It's fine. I'll take the three. So Hurts is off, and on comes Jake Elliott for the Eagle field goal. The kick by Elliott is good. I'll take three. It's fine. It's whatever. I saw Britton Covey late. Cover three cloud. The Colts come to the line ready to start their next drive. They're sort of seeing themselves spiral out of control. Oh, read. And this is where the coach is walking out. Cover on all. Being calm and really being firm with his team. Add one, tell me once, you know, when we're having a tough patch. This two shall pass, this two shall pass, and if I we kept having a rough patch, he said, but you gotta do something up. to make it pass. And that's what they have to do. They've got to get some control back, get mm. themselves reasserted, and calm things down. See if they can get Come on. reassert themselves here. Third and twelve. Back to throw. Here's Richardson. Pick that. Or don't Zach Cunningham. Or don't Zach Cunningham. By get bitched by fucking Mo Alley Cox, I guess. Cover six. Or no, it wasn't even him. It was Granison. Who the fuck even is that? Unbelievable. Now a toss left side into the hands of his tight end. The Colts gonna use the first of their timeouts. Cover nine shit too. He gets ball at half, so. Back to throw it. And his throw is incomplete. So many times we talk about covers, we're just about the defender. Number six. The receiver, but a big part of it is understanding where the football is, finding it. In this case, when it arrived, it wasn't a surprise, and he was able to bat it away. Flush to his right. Able to find yeah. the man. That's complete. Reed Blankenship, how did you bite that fucking hard? Now the Colts gonna burn the second of their fucking idiot, bro. So that means they're down to one remaining here. As 60 pinch. A chance now to get even before the break as they come up first and goal. 
Again, it's Richardson. Wow, Kevin Byron. You got smoked on that row, buddy. Kevin Byard, bro, what are you doing? Bro, got fucking smoked on that row. 10 10. Alright, bro, 41 seconds. Give me that. That's fine, I'll take it. Oh, perfect. From a couple yards deep, he'll bring it out of the end zone. Oh, come on. Just hold it for a second longer. I would have been gone. HP slip screen. Oh, look at that. We got left side of the fucking screen. Left side of the field, sorry. You're good. You're good. Nice. Big time out. Why so? The Eagles going to take the first of their timeouts as they get it right at the 32nd mark of this first half. Line of scrimmage, the 37 on first and 10. Hurts. Rolling to oh. his right. Looking here for Smith downfield. He's got it. Nice. Good shit, Devontae. Why was he wide open? Take it. Why so? Take a timeout. Now the Eagles will use the second of their timeouts. So that means they're down to one remaining here as we drive toward halftime. The line of scrimmage, the seven now on second and goal. Here's Hertz to throw. Ah, oh, Devontae. But it's incomplete. I'm really liking what I'm seeing from this defense because their coverage has been playing at a shutdown level so far. Even backed up late. They're forcing incompletions and fighting to keep them at the end zone. As I don't know. What do I want to run here? Double slant flat, I guess. Sure. They've been denied touchdowns in the red zone. I'm gonna run inside so zone. Here comes third and goal. They will run it with Swift here. Thank you. DeAndre Swift. Let's go. Elliot now to have the extra point. 17 10. He's got it as they go up. A total of 17 to 10. Told you it was not worried. So not much time to work with here. Nine seconds remain in the half as this one is away. And here comes a return from just beyond the goal line. I said. And he will be brought down here inside the 20. Good coverage as he's dropped at the 17. <sighs> oh, cover two, man. A final shot before the half. Richardson. Nice. And he's going to go down. Couldn't get a throw. All right, 17 10 at half. For the best as that brings us to the end of this first half of play. So two quarters down, two remain. Charles and I return after the break. And we welcome you back now alongside Charles Davis and right. Brandon Gordon getting set for quarter number three here. One touchdown is the difference. 17-10 our score, and we are back underway on EA Sports. This fielded right at the goal line. That's it. And no alley to be found. The coverage was solid, and he's dropped at the 18. Cover one hole. The Indy offense at the line and set to go. 
But Charles, we saw a pretty entertaining first half, close ball game. Remember there toward the end of the second Oh, Reddick, if you would have gone off that block, could have had a fucking pick six right there. Go three cloud. Yeah, they want to have that type of a response, don't they? Because they want to find a way to take control of this ball game one more time. Goblin's been thrown down. They want to see if they're ready to answer. Nice. Richardson, another throw on second down, and this one again complete as well. Cover nine, show two. Nice sack, Josh Sweat. Yeah, go for it. Overload. Pick that. Thank you. James Bradbury. Good shit, James. Well, Charles, just some visibly frustrated players and coaches on that sideline right now because those halftime adjustments didn't work. The turnover problems continuing here in the second half, and the defense now sitting pretty comfortably as a result of that pick six. Hey, that's a great observation. Fucking too, episode of pick sixes, bruh. You quitting? Did make adjustments you didn't quit. Half -time. But how about this other group staying a step ahead despite whatever happened in that other line? 24-10. No surprise they're leading, and it's appropriate. Did those defenders get to end? Maybe put in Vinci? Elliot good with a PAT. And a lead now up to 14. So they throw the pick six. They'll get another shot at it now as this one's in the air. Taken at the goal line. All right, nice hit. Brought down right on the chalk of the 20. Cover three club. The Colts come to the line ready to start their next drive. Yeah, we're probably uh, gonna have to make two fucking best moments videos because there's too many clips. Especially with all these pick sixes. Nice hit. Tampa two contain. Can they put that aside? Kind of start over and put together a nice drive. I clicked on, I, I clicked on everybody but I, who I wanted to play as. All right, cover three sky for us. Pick that. Thank you, James. Get him. Of course, Anthony Richardson is there. Charles, you hate to see this. RPR read for, Oh, and he's gone. Very right, cool. A win is 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 a win. Love it. Love it. Love it. 65 and 75. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to drop a like, subscribe if you're new. And until my next video, I'll see you guys when I see you guys. Peace.